you can use reports with cross filters to look deep into your data without doing any coding. Cross filters let you include or exclude records in your report results based on related objects and their fields. In this demo, we'll show you some ways to narrow down a search to find just the records you need. We'll see how you can create an exception report to find accounts that don't have contacts listed, and we'll show you how to cross-filter for opportunities that need follow-up. Let's say you're in charge of cleaning up your company's data, and you want to find all accounts that don't have a contact listed. We know that the contacts object is a child object of accounts, so let's set up an accounts report. We'll add a filter and select the cross filters option. You can cross filter on any object that's related to an object on your report. That includes standard objects and any custom objects that your admin may have provided for your organization. We need to pick a filter condition that expresses what we want to find out. In this case, we'll use the without condition. You can see all of the child objects of the account object here in this column. We're going to select Contacts and click OK. With a few clicks, we've just created an exception report to zero in on customer accounts that don't have contacts associated with them. You can use field filters to further narrow down your results. For example, to help you get the most important stuff first, try filtering out any competitor accounts. You can filter using both with and without conditions. Say you're the sales manager and you want to see how your team is doing on closing their opportunities. You want to find all accounts with opportunities that are closing in the next 30 days that don't have activities planned in the next 30 days. We'll add a cross filter. Accounts with opportunities. This time we'll also add a subfilter by clicking Add Opportunities Filter and selecting Close Date equals Next 30 Days. Each cross filter can have five subfilters. Next, let's add another cross filter for accounts without activities and a subfilter for Date equals Next 30 Days. Each report can have up to three cross filters. When we run that report, we have a list of accounts that need a follow up from our sales team. That's a quick look at how you can use cross filters to look deep into your data without doing any coding. It's quick and easy, and you can do it right in the report builder. For more information, look for these topics in Salesforce help and training. And thanks for using Salesforce.